Annabelle, are we going to do some chocolate pudding painting? Yeah. All you need is some jello pudding mix or jello pudding cups. Just like this. If you have a little one that eats paint or crayons or something, okay. then just try having them paint with pudding. Okay. Here, you use your fingers. Get them covered with an apron like this, where they're totally covered if you want. You can even put something on the ground in case it spills, but we're in the kitchen on a wipeable surface. Yes, Bubba? Can we eat that? Uh, yes, you can eat that. But you can paint with it. Annabelle, dip and put your finger. And they can basically just finger paint with the chocolate pudding. And if they eat it, then it's no big deal. Sure. The, the, uh, on that chocolate. Yeah. Paint. Put your finger and paint. Get it paint. There. So then, and you just paint on a wipeable surface or you can bring your hey, easel she, or something outside. Mom, hey mom, she ate it. She did? Yeah, she ate that chocolate. And you can see that she's painting and eating. Aren't you, Annabelle? But, uh, but mom, Annabelle, paint! Uh, I need a paintbrush. Uh, 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 I'm gonna eat and paint. Uh, Annabelle, she eats whatever still. She's almost 19 months and she still will eat crayons, eat paint, eat markers. So, I figured this is a way she can kind of enjoy painting and kind of have it both ways. You want to sit at the table with a spoon? Yeah, on the paper. Yeah, on the paper. Tell Daddy, Daddy, come look. Yeah, Daddy, yeah, Daddy. Yeah, go, Daddy. Let me see. <gasps> Are you, oh, you doing pudding paint? Uh, but I'm eating. Oh, <laughs> you're eating the pudding and she's painting the pudding, huh? I bet you she's eating. Wow! What are you making? What are you making? Can you do a circle? Dip your finger and do a circle. Ooh! Circle. That's not a circle. That's some good lines though. More. Yeah, more. Ooh, ooh. Is that good? I don't know if this is going to reinforce her eating paint more or, or not, but it's a fun activity. Good job. And this is just an apron I got at Ikea. They come in a two-pack for really cheap, and it just it really covers everything so that it keeps them. It's actually what we use for a bib, too, because especially early on when Annabelle didn't use a fork or a spoon, she would eat a lot with her fingers, and it would be really messy. She would never stay clean, but this helps keep her somewhat clean.